Hey, what is up YouTube? Small Text Reviews here. And uh, today I have a quick video on showing you the charging power of cell phone chargers charging a 2016 MacBook Pro. Now what I have here in front of me is a couple of chargers uh, that I use. And uh, the one right here in the bottom right is a Huawei Quick Charge. Now the reason I got this out is because um, when I had the Huawei Honor 8, it came with a quick charge uh, USB-C cable and charger. Um, so as you can see here, it's kind of difficult to, to see, oh there it is. If you can see that output right there, it's either 5 volts at 2 amps or 9 volts at 2 amps. And to figure out the wattage of that, you just multiply volts in amps and you'll get a wattage. Um, so 5 volts, 2 amps, 10, that's 10 watts there. 9 volts, 2 amps is 18 watts. So I uh, want to take a look at to see if this will actually help out the laptop or not. And so we have that on, I'm going to put that off to the side. And then what we have here is this is a, a charger that I've had for quite some time now. And this is a multi-port USB uh, charger. Now the reason I got this as opposed to just let's say a standard uh, wall charger is because this one here, let's see if we can move the camera here, uh, doesn't really give you exactly how many uh, amps uh, each port gives you. It just says that uh, it could take, you know, of course it could take six uh, six USB devices, um, five volts with a maximum of 10 amps. Uh, I've charged my iPad with this and, uh, I've gotten great numbers, great amperage, uh, close to that 2.4 amps. So let's just see what, it, you know, what it does. Um, so let's just go ahead and get started. I'm going to play it. it in any port doesn't really tell you which one gives you how many so I'll just plug into the middle one to play it safe and um, oh and uh, one last thing to measure it um, I have here a USB type C uh, power meter type C is gonna go into the MacBook Pro and also the the power source gonna go through here and we're just gonna go ahead and take a look at you know the uh, you know the volume the amperage of it and the volts it won't this will not read watts you all you got to do is just kind of figure you know do the math and uh you'll uh you'll figure out the watts um and and last thing here i have a usb type c and a usb type a connector here and this is uh, came with the huawei 8 so it's definitely more incapable of delivering those 18 watts if we can uh, you know achieve that um but uh, let's go ahead and get started. Uh, first, I'm gonna do the multi, the multi port here. Pretty easy. It's already plugged into the wall. Just go ahead and plug that in. Plug in the. This one doesn't turn. Oh, there we go. Actually, this one did turn on. So we're just gonna go ahead and uh, you know plug it in and see how it goes. All right, so. One thing about this is it does not turn, you know, the other way. So we're just gonna go ahead and do this, and just give it a little bit, kind of, to, you know, get those numbers up. As you can see, the volts uh, start off, at, I believe, at 4.4 volts, and uh, it's hovering around 4.7 at 2.36 amps. So you kind of, I knew that amperage was up there. I knew it was up there, so uh, that probably, I don't know, just kind of do the math there, 4.7 volts roughly to 2.35 to play safe, and that'll give you the wattage. Um, so we're close to that, you know, 10 watts of power, and this is coming from, you know, from the multi-port there. Yep, so definitely capable. And as you can see, that arrow too, that means the power is going, you know, of course, from there all the way to the laptop. 
All right, so not bad. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and plug in the Huawei quick charger. Uh, let's see what it gives us for power. So I went ahead and unplugged it. I'm gonna unplug just to make sure everything gets reset. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and plug this in here. I'm gonna go ahead and plug this into the wall. All right, uh, does it turn on? Yes, it does. All right, and let's go ahead and check this out. All right. So I plugged that in and <laughs> it's only giving us five watts of power. It's kind of strange. That is kind of strange that this is roughly giving us a little bit less than five watts of power. And you can tell too by that bottom uh, number, that's the milliamp hours that have been, uh, I guess, output from the charger to the laptop and it's pretty slow. It's just that little few minutes that I had it on the other one. It was already, what, I believe above 50 milliamp. So, and uh, yeah, so there you have it. Um, charging a 2016 MacBook Pro using laptop chargers. Uh, that's something you just have to test. Unfortunately, you know, the, the uh, MacBook wouldn't be able to, you know, tell you like this in real time. Uh, I'm sure you can look at the the actual settings of the port that you plugged into the laptop and it'll tell you, you know, what the maximum, you know, output of it is. But um, in real time, this is what we have. Um, so I would just try different devices and, um, you know, that's really all I have. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to leave any comments down below and, uh, you know, hit that like button and uh, I'll ask if you could subscribe for more, you know, quick videos like this. I'll see you in the next one.